welcome to the Judging Yourself. Bless your home, Judging the Way, and now, Judging the Way. Um, welcome to the Justin and Wade show. I'm Justin. That's Wade. This is season two of the Justin and Wade show. And in this season, we are asking each other five questions each episode. Um, the other person has one minute to answer each question. If I find that question entertaining or I want to hear more, I will let him continue. If I don't, I'll just cut him off at the minute and we will go on. There is this little side thing we got going on where we have the option to lie. <laughs> um, don't know why Wade makes us laugh every time. Because um, there are no rules here. <laughs> and we will try to figure out if the other person is lying. The we'll Justin Wade show is complete anarchy. Out. What's that? The Justin Wade show is complete anarchy. There are no <laughs> rules here. So all the stuff we're telling you doesn't like even matter. All right. So let's go ahead and get into it because we are a little short for time because we have a guest today. Um, let me get my timer ready. It cut off on me. I apologize. All right. Wait, are you ready for the first question? Yep. All right. Have you ever had a Karen encounter? And what? Have explain it. A Karen encounter. Like a, can I say? Like your a manager? Like a, yeah, like, you know, a, a Karen. Like, have you ever come across somebody that you would call a Karen? Yeah. All right. Explain it to us, please. <clears throat> um, in my professions, like when you work around construction and stuff like that, sometimes you get people that like you get you you're around a lot of men, like manly men. Yeah. And and you find a lot of those manly men like when they get their manhood <laughs> tested. Mm. So this way, this is this is what I would call, which it's so weird to use like a person's name as a derogatory yeah. term. You have 10 but, seconds left. But yeah, but to get a man and then when you like question them and they go like tell your manager like you're gonna get in trouble you know it's somebody that acts well, like they want to beat you up yeah. and then they go tell your manager behind your back like, yeah, yeah yeah i've run into some people like that uh, okay i gotcha all right no that was good i like it um all right question two now this is the one that's really stupid um i'm sorry just, this is the one. This is the one <laughs> question I've ever asked. That's I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna say that's a lot. <laughs> Wait, that's my job, right? Oh, All right. There are thirty cows in a field, and twenty-eight chickens. How many didn't? How many didn't? Your one minute starts now. <laughs> How many did it? Like, like the preposition did not. Yes. <clears throat> the aliens. Nope. <laughs> You're already wrong. <laughs> um, donuts. If you want me to repeat the question, I will. Repeat the question. There are 30 cows in the field and 28 chickens. How many didn't? How many did not? Cross the road? I will tell you the answer if you can't figure it out. Two. That is incorrect. Um, pizza. <laughs> no, that's incorrect as well, but a good guess. You're getting closer. Okay. I have no idea. This question, right. is, you're speaking nonsense. All right. So the answer is 10. Wow. There are 30 cows in the field, and 20 of them eight chickens 10 of them did not eat any chickens okay right. next question did you make that you just read this somewhere like no i've heard it before <clears throat> i enjoyed it because i actually got it correct um all right how is your house decorated uh comic book stuff um skulls plants what kind of plants um, I don't know. Melody's mm. the one that likes plants. So yeah, same here. Girlie's got plants and I have no clue what they are. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, don't, I don't have <laughs> any clue. Um it's a mixture of me and Melody. I mean, like we like old like tin signs and things like that. Nice. Um, um and then yeah, I just have different comic book stuff that will work into like our we just bought like an antique chair at the thrift store that's mm -hmm. got pineapples on it. 
like I don't I don't know. It's just like a pineapple print, but it's like an old looking, yeah, yeah. Like, antique chair. Um, that's cool. Uh it's hard to say. Very good. No, that was good. That was good. That's probably how thrift I thrift store to chic. What's that? Thrift store chic is your stuff. That's <laughs> all right. Very good. <clears throat> all right, next one. Also dealing with decorations. Where, by the way, we're going to stay with decoration questions from here on out. What's your opinion on Christmas decorations already being for sale? Uh, all that. Yeah, the whole, all that's annoying. Is it? I mean, there should, there, I'm not, I'm not saying there shouldn't be places where you can buy Christmas decorations year round, but the whole, I mean, it's just for money. It's just, right. oh, let's get it out as soon as possible. That's all, that's all it's become. And the holidays in general, like, it's all set up, you know, to retail by a holiday. You know what I mean? As soon as one holiday's over, they're pushing the next one or even before it at this point, as, as you're saying. So Yeah, there's already Christmas decorations for sale these days. It's just, I mean, I like Christmas. It's just, it's annoying. Yeah, I like Christmas also. I agree. Do you really, do you, well, I'll, I'll, get, I'll get into that in the next question, but that's a good answer. Yeah, I personally don't care too much about it. It used to bother me, but now it's like, yeah, it's retail. It is what I mean, it is. It, it is irrelevant to me. If I mean, people are going to buy it, people are going to buy it. If not, they'll stop doing it. So. All right. Good one. Good one. And the last one is also about Christmas decorations. When do you start decorating for Christmas? And what kind of stuff do you decorate? Uh, the beginning of December is usually when we would think about it. Yeah. But usually it's probably 10 to the middle of December is when we do it. Um, okay. We had trees a few years. We had some really nice trees a few years when we had a big house before. Um, <clears throat> now we're, and we have lots of decorations. My mom had lots of decorations. So okay. Like Christmas, not decorations like that. My bad, uh, ornaments. So yeah, yeah, yeah. lots of Christmas tree ornaments. But um, <laughs> now we have a couple of small, like, lighted trees. They're just these white, like, birch looking mm -hmm tree things that we keep up year round at this point but um nice. and then we just have we just have a couple of boxes of yes christmas random christmas decorations that we've gotten from our parents and people over the years that we just yeah. put out the house very cool yep. sounds good do you, do you decorate outside uh not really we we i mean we have christmas lights um <clears throat> but we haven't no uh, i don't know what we're going to do this year melody's talking about it but we'll see Okay, cool. Well, that is my five questions. Thank you for joining me today, Wade. Uh, and thank you to all our viewers for joining in. Uh, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, share, let us know how you're doing. And we're looking for guests. If you want to be a guest on the show, make sure to hit us up. Um, right, have a good one.